thanksgiving in our hearts for the freedom we enjoy as America. Janet and Mrs. Shelton, and ladies and gentlemen. Today, amid present and past, distinguished guests, including the proud veterans who join us here to honor the words that now grace the Vietnam tomb, honoring and keeping faith with America's missing servicemen, they are carved in stone. Their permanence, like our remembrance of America's foreign, fallen soldiers, sailors, airmen, and Marines, will be a measure of this nation's profound reverence and respect. And those words will always remain. An example of faith and loyalty to our nation. He's a strong and he's an unbroken man. Max Freeman. I think for those of us who are soldiers, that's our one fear, that somehow we'll be forgotten. But let it be known far and wide around this great nation and around this great world that this nation does not forget. It does not forget its disabled veterans. It does not forget its POWs. And for certain, it does not forget its MIAs and the families they represent. I believe it's an important inscription and um, because we must honor, we can never forget those who have um, given their lives for their country and we must be able to keep the faith. If, if there's no faith, if we don't believe that our country would, you know, bring our servicemen home, it's just not right. And so I believe that the inscription is excellent and that it says everything it needs to.